Gamer 7 and welcome back to some more of the Not So Bad Challenge. We have fun here because Nanali is still at work, but Nanali should be getting a promotion this time. Well, I'm sorry. Anyway, she should hopefully be getting a promotion this time. So we're waiting for her to get back. What is Fawn doing? I just don't want you... Leave me alone. Um, I should make Connor work hard. Just just to make sure to make up for the performance loss that I accidentally made him have. Um, she's already mat auto automatically working hard. So taking a little bit after her mother, but I am going to have her like make friends the next time. Just because, you know, it'd be nice to meet some other fellow astronauts, maybe. So we'll see how that goes. But um, right now, she, you're stinky. You should go take a bath or something. We don't have a toddler running around now because <laughs> Carrie and them are gone, actually. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm right where I left off in the last spot. So we're just waiting for... Sorry to bother you. Not interested. <laughs> I should have just went and done it. I'm sorry. I'm a horrible person. Um, anyway, waiting for Nanali to get home, which she sh she gets home at five. Yeah, five. So should be soonish. And after that, I'm gonna have to do a very complex thing. To oh, did we get promoted? Yes! Oh, Connor came home too. We got promoted. We got promoted. Anyway. <laughs> so. <laughs> to, for anyone who maybe wants to do something like this later on, I will, I won't go through the whole process. Like, at least showing the whole process. I'll explain the whole process. But basically, to make sure that I keep the cow plant, the same cow plant that we've had this whole entire time. Um, with my current gin, when they're moving... I put them in the inventory. Here they are. And in this case, I'm also going to put Lulu the second in the inventory. There he is. Uh, because we definitely want to take that stuff with us. And anything else that I want to take with us, I'm going to put in the inventory. It can also go into your Sims inventory, but something like the cow plant. And I think like something like this, like the little small animals, if you do have my first pet stuff, I know a lot of people hate that, that stuff pack. I don't particularly care for it um, because the way they did it. I like the stuff in it. Don't get me wrong. I do like the stuff in it. Um, but I admit it annoys me how they did it because I felt like there was too much stuff connected to cats and dogs. Um, so yeah. If they also if they would have just added like snakes and stuff in there too and like made it a little bit more of its own thing, would not have mind. But yeah, so I put anything that I want to keep in the inventory as it is. Then I also save the house in this state. Granted, I'm gonna demolish like get rid of some of this stuff. I'm gonna act like Carrie either took this stuff with her or she sold it, and that was part of the way to. Uh, keep up with some money for their house but anyway um and they just paid that back to Fawn and Connor because we're going with that they borrowed money from them to be able to get a house but I do save this house because I do I do put I did put the mint household up and I want to put this one Rose Jen home and so I do put these up in the gallery for anyone who wants to download them. So the Mint House is up on the gallery. It actually has two versions. It has the starting version, which has no CC in it. And then the end version, how I ended the house when I left. Because I made a lot of modifications to that house. And this one uh, also obviously will have CC. I will change this when I go to actually upload it. But for now... Save a new because it's trying to override. Because this was actually a house that I built, but it looked different. So technically, you can get this house for the most part without CC, but the color scheme is going to be different and it's going to be have some of the rooms changed a bit. But you can still get this version if you want. It just won't have all the stuff unless you somehow have all the same CC as I have. Like I said, I put everything that I want to keep in the inventory that can't go into the Sims inventory. 
I save the house. And then I go to move the new generation out. Like, I move... <laughs> um, technically, I, I will move Fawn and Connor out temporarily. And then I'll go to move Nana Lee. So... It will technically try to sell all this stuff for her, so I'm going to keep a mental note of how much money I want her to have. And then after that, I actually will come back to the, like, move Fawn and Connor back into this lot and replace the house. That's why I save the house before I do it, because I do have to replace the house, because it basically makes you either take all the furniture with you or sell all the furniture. Oh, that is not what I meant to do. I was talking about selling and look what I did. So yeah, it's sort of annoying that it doesn't give you the option to just leave the house alone. Um, because like, let's say you, you're moving, but you want to leave the furniture in there so that if you move in Sims later on, there's at least some furniture to start out with, even if it doesn't stay that way. But yeah, so that's sort of the whole process. I All right, so obviously this is not the money that I'm going to keep her with. I actually have how much money I was going to, like, they were going to give her to move out. And I'm going to take the price of the lot that we're moving into, which is going to be right here, which is, so minus three, six, three, two. So now I know how much money to set her down to. So I, there's no house on this lot right now, so we are going to be, um, having to build our own house or at least set up a tent to start off with because you know, maybe we'll buy the buy the rocket first <laughs> not really not really we're gonna build a house <gasps> um so yeah uh this is gonna be rose just bought a house as is but um rose um fawn rose did but donnelly is going to be sort of starting from scratch and building a house so this is gonna be fun um Maybe in some ways, while she's getting the house built, we can pretend that she had the house being built um, with keeping in mind how much money her parent parent was going to give her <laughs> and had something started before we actually physically moved here. But, you know, this is imagination! <laughs> That's what we're going to go with. So, this is where we're at. <laughs> this, is, this is our lovely little area that we have. Oh, there's some dragonflies. <laughs> we got some dragonflies <laughs> flying around. Is there any fish? I don't see any fish. Sadly. It does say you can fish. Can go fishing. I don't see any fish, though. <laughs> but it says you can go fishing. Um, but yeah, this is this is where we at. Why is, <laughs> why is there a mailbox in the cactus? <laughs> okay, whatever. Um, not gonna worry about that. Oh. <laughs> we are going to set her money to what it should be. So four, six, three, six, eight. Set it, not add it. <laughs> so this is how much money we're gonna have. I went with like they gave her fifty thousand to start a house and start her life. <laughs> so here's the thing. I don't know actually how I want to go about building this house. Do I want it to be lifted, actually? And, like, actually, like, not, t like, take the time to weed all this, <laughs> per se? Maybe. I don't know. But, yeah, this is where we're living. I am going to at least take down these fences over here. Or at least this one, because this one's, like, getting really close into my walkway here. <laughs> or what I'm envisioning to be my walkway. So... This is what we have now. Right now, Fawn currently is not in the house, but we're, we're not going to worry about that. We're just, you know. But. There's a lot of things on the pond. Um, it still had me keep some of the stuff, even though I said sell the furniture. I'm going to have to reset her money back. Okay. Let me sell the stuff that she wasn't keeping. We got the stuff that we wanted to keep. I'm not going to place them just yet because I I don't think I could fix... <gasps> I can fix it from this screen. Yes. Thank goodness. I don't have to go back to live mode to, to fix it. Yes. Thank goodness. Okay. So I know that wasn't like a whole lot of money, but still. Um, we have to start building a house now. 
And I, I do want, um, oh, I gotta think, where do I want the rocket ship? It's gonna have to be back here, but I feel like, okay, listen, we're gonna pretend that this tree was a little bit further over, maybe slightly spun, we're gonna <laughs> slightly move everything and just pretend that it was over this way to begin with. <laughs> um we need room for the rocket ship so this is going to be the rocket ship's little area because even if we don't buy the rocket ship right away we want to know where the rocket ship is going to be so i think the rocket ship is like a three by three i want to say but because of the fact i'm going to scoot it back further than this but i can't put the fence here so it'd be like here, so that's four, and then, so this is just where we're going to eventually put our rocket ship is over this way, so that we know where the rocket ship is going. Um, <laughs> but, and don't worry, I'm not going to like keep all of this in, so you don't have to sit here and watch me build for like really long periods of time, but I think I want to make her house like sort of funky I do think can I do the foundation I don't think I can do the foundation because is it going to get rid of some of the stuff on the ground for some reason I thought so I'm just going to start with this real quick because I want to boop the foundation up why do we always already have lights on our foundation? What the heck? Anyway, um, because I was thinking about maybe doing this weird situation. Why not? I want to do it a little bit funky. So we're going to build everything off of this just because why not? Okay, to update you on the process going on with building this house, this is what I got so far. I'm actually liking this house a lot for me to be doing it like on the fly and like really quickly. Um, obviously, like, eventually I'll do a few more tweaking here and there. I feel like maybe there should be a pillar there as well. I am trying, like, when it comes to the colors and stuff, obviously with the mint house, it definitely was very, very much mint. Um, but at the same time, that just looked really cute and I really liked the whole aesthetic. And I still brought in some normal colors to try to make it not look too, too crazy. And I feel like... I don't know, that color just worked for being like majorly the house. But to be honest with you, there's not a whole lot of yellows unless I was like to go like a certain direction, but I still want it to look semi like it might fit in with the rest of these houses and stuff like that, sort of. But I still am tying in the yellows and I think it's looking pretty good. And I actually really like the yellow and grays together and obviously adding a little bit of black. So that's sort of what I'm going with. There is technically an upstairs thing, but that's mainly for aesthetic purposes as of right now. <laughs> now eventually, because especially the way I have the downstairs created here, and like I don't know how much y'all have seen by now, I'll probably like add, keep some of it in the video and like speed it up. Do like a section where I speed up and stuff. But um, on the inside, I'm definitely going trying to put a little bit more yellow than what's in the outside. Some of it will be with the furniture. But yeah, I eventually will have to use like an upstairs section. And some of the rooms might shrink as I move things around. Like, I don't know how. Because like this is going to be a study, but this is like a really pretty big study and stuff like that. I might try to add like a bathroom somewhere along the ways. Technically, there's not a master bath, but we'll, we'll see how that goes. Also, this tree is sort of... Loki annoying me. Um, we're just gonna totally pretend that it's been facing that direction the whole entire time. <laughs> um, so yeah, right now this is gonna be her bedroom. This is gonna be like a little study area. This is the living room, kitchen, dining, and then a bathroom. And then this is the entryway. So this is what we got going on so far. I am trying- oh I didn't put any flooring in the living room. I actually- I don't know if I want to do wood or carpet. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to keep to grays and blacks along with the yellow. That's sort of what I'm doing. But, and I have to do some creams and tans here and there because it's just like, 
really hard to get yellow, especially like when it comes to certain things, like flooring especially. But yeah. So this is, oh, I don't have a tour to the bathroom. Let me fix that. <laughs> so yeah, this is what I got. This is a pretty small living room. I think what eventually will happen is like whenever I do go to connect the upstairs, like actually have an legit upstairs, this will probably become like, I will probably scoot this over. Like we'll move some walls over and this will become the living room. And this will just be like a second entryway, but it's just going out and also a stairway sort of situation. And this will become like a, not a this will stay a bedroom, but not Nonalee's bedroom. And Nonalee's will go upstairs. But for now, upstairs is not being used. So I'm going to go in and especially like I'm going to prioritize the bathroom, the kitchen, and the bedroom. And then we'll go from there. I'm sort of hoping to be able to get the, the rocket ship already. But we'll see how that goes after I start adding this other stuff. But wanted to update you on how the house is going. So I'll be back. <laughs> I am done for now, which there's not a whole lot in the house, which it's fine. I did decide to prioritize the rocket over potentially adding living room stuff and think, oh wait, <laughs> I still have stuff in my inventory, like um, our pet Lulu the second. <gasps> Let me get you out there, buddy. <laughs> You're going to be one of the only things in this room. <laughs> How does that make you feel? Well, I guess I'll just leave that in there for now because uh, we don't have anything. We got we got those. We got we got some pictures of those. And we got I don't know where this is going. Let's get going because this is now my house. I don't have to put everything just in my bedroom. I can put it in other parts of the house as well. So. I think everything else I'll just wait on. Also, if you hear my heater in the background, I apologize. It started getting really cold. It's actually snowing outside, so I'll... Yeah, anyway, okay. Now that we get Lulu the second out of the inventory, let's continue on with our day. So we... Oh. <laughs> Wrong button, me. Apparently Lulu the second's also growing old, so... There's that. But we now technically feel food talk. So we do have the thing because we do now have a rocket ship. So that is nice. And we have a house, but um, we have the bare minimum in the house. I didn't want to go too crazy with decorations and stuff. Just yet, because I am still recording, and it is getting a little bit late at night, and I do have to work tomorrow. I'll fix the mailbox situation later. I also forgot to get rid of this, but it's fine, 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 it's fine. Still working on process. But um, after I get a little bit more money in, I will... Oh yeah, and it costs money to build it on top of that. Um, once I get a little bit of money in, I will actually like decorate the house a little bit more and use decorations and stuff like that off camera but for now this is this is what we got so we're gonna go ahead and build the rocket ship now actually before we build the rocket let's actually i did get a really expensive toilet because why not it had yellow on it <laughs> well it's technically gold but you know Does it look like there's something glowing and alien? Oh, I now see fish. <laughs> it's like something glowing in my in this pond in my backyard. <gasps> look at the little dapples. Do they turn into frogs? Do they do they ever turn into frogs? Anyway, we got like abundance of wildlife out here. I can collect the insect. Interesting. Okay, we're gonna go build the rocket. <laughs> I'm getting distracted by bugs and fish. That fish just went. Yeah, oh, and that one did too. They're going inside <laughs> the edges of the world, <laughs> whatever. And the cow plant is actually moving. Yay! That's always a good thing. Am I running? Uh, I'm gonna sort of run into this tree. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. 
<laughs> we are on a pretty small size lot to be putting a um, rocket ship on, especially when there's already like a pond and stuff, but I think our house is a decent size, so you know, hey, that's cool. Um, it barely has anything in it, but hey, yep, yeah, that's fine. What, what is this? No, oh, from feeding the rodent. I don't, never noticed that there was a moodlet for that. But we are now building the rocket! Yay! It still says I've completed the chest set. Playing chest, even though I haven't. Is the astronaut career being weird for me? Oh, well. I'll worry about that later. Yeah! <laughs> so. I also don't know why it was doing a weird clipping issue over here, and I'm not even sure why it was doing that, but... I tried moving the ground a bit to see- oh gosh! To see if that's what it was, but I didn't see anything. I wonder if our alien friends have become adults yet. Hello? Um, can't, but it's nice talking to you. You have never been in my life! Why do you want to be there now? Gosh, stop doing that. I just want to see if my alien friends... Still teen. Are you... They're twins, right? I'm pretty sure they're twins, so... If if she's a teen, then he's gonna be a teen. And if he's a teen, she's gonna be a teen. Oh! I gotta feed the cat plants. Part of me is a little hopeful that, you know... Maybe we can get close to this particular alien. I mean, we are going to go visit Sixum eventually, so, you know. I really would like her to be with an alien, just because I think it's fitting that she gets with an alien. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. I really... <laughs> I, want, I want alien. Alien significant other is what I want. So, but hopefully when we go to Sixum, uh, we can meet more aliens so we have more options. Um... I do need you to feed the cow plant. And we're also getting a little on the sleepy side. I don't have a chest set, by the way. Didn't think about that. I'm gonna need that for work. But right now it says complete, so we'll see what happens. But, uh, <laughs> this is, uh, how things are going for now. So I do need to. I don't know how long it's gonna. It sort of looks like it. it looks like there's a missile thing pointed at the rock ship, so you know. There's a- that. <laughs> Gonna let her work on it for a little bit longer. Just cause I want it to get as close to be- like I want it to get done as fast as possible, basically. Reach rocket science level three. <laughs> okay. I'll go ahead and let her feed the cow plant. And I didn't go with her space bed this time because I figured like there's a part of her that's like, yeah, I really like the space stuff, but also I'm an adult now, so I really need to at least, you know, be thinking of the fact that I probably should tone it down a little bit. But in the end, she's going to end up putting a whole bunch of space stuff everywhere. Just right now, she doesn't have the money for that. Right now, she's thinking, I just moved in. I want to prove that I'm a responsible, mature adult type situation and then once she gets like more comfortable in her new place then she'll probably start decorating space stuff everywhere and I, also as she finds it oh well this has gotten dirty immediately oh uh, so that's fun i just hear the cow plants bell going <laughs> oh we're already up so we're gonna clean that and then at least we do have a kitchen so that we can actually make food. It's an odd time in the day, so like it's like, I eh, can't register what you want to do. Because it's not really breakfast, but it's not supper either, so. Or dinner. And my, my, my family on my dad's side calls lunchtime dinner, and it bothers the crap out of me. I'm like, no, dinner and supper are the same thing. I just think of dinner being a fancier version of a supper. <laughs> Personally, that's how I think of it, and that's how it's been used. Because, like, Christmas, dinner. Thanksgiving, dinner. So those are, like, big events for, like, a supper situation, but it's a dinner. <laughs> I also will update her style eventually. Um, but, you know, she just became a young adult, so I think she would still be reusing her teen clothes for now. But I will give her, like, a slight makeover. Um, Soonish. Maybe by the next episode, or... At least after the next episode. Somewhere. Before or after the next episode, definitely. 
Oh, I'm glad she did decide. To, what is it? Oh, the single and loving it. Yeah, you're eventually gonna have to um get rid of that. Just saying. We reached cooking level six. <laughs> she's excited over a sandwich. I mean, I guess maybe it's more of a situation she's moved out on her own and she's like, oh, I'm out on my own. I've made my first meal in my own house. <laughs> I mean, I would do that. I would, I would be pretty excited. <laughs> like, it's something that maybe if you say it out loud, it doesn't seem that exciting. But when it happens, you're like, oh. <laughs> my, my empty house. Um, but hey, I got a house. <laughs> that's all that matters. So after she does all this, even though she doesn't have to use the bathroom that bad actually, I'm gonna let her go ahead and use the bathroom so we can go back to building the rocket ship and just stay on the- <gasps> Is there fireflies out here now? Ooh. Oh. <laughs> we want to stay on the rocket ship as long as possible so that's what we're- well she's on this side now. I wonder how long it's gonna take to put this- I don't think I've seen- has there any ha happened any changes on this rocket ship? I don't know, there's not a green- oh, there definitely is a change now. But there's not like a green thing going around this, so I can't tell how long before, you know. It's done. My logic skill for this should be great, because I think my logic skill is already up to like a 7 or an 8. Pretty sure. Something along those lines. Um. I'm gonna feed you again. When do I go into work? I go in at 12. Okay, so I got a bit of time before. Also, eventually we'll have to pay a visit to the park. But I don't have my handiness skill all the way up, so... Oh, she's having the memory of the fire. I'm like, what? What? Fi where's the fire? Oh, there's no fire. You just have a memory. <gasps> Reach level 4 of the racket side. Actually, this computer is turned off on me and I actually can't see- I already got bills! I just moved in! Oh gosh. This is a very bright red screen over here right now. I might have a welcome wagon. I'm having a welcome wagon, aren't I? Couldn't reach your mailbox. Welcome to the neighborhood. I don't know who you are because your picture is not loading in, but thanks! I'm actually trying to work on my rocket ship, but I guess I should be neighborly. I guess I should be, I actually, but, you know, real quickly. Uh, woo! Rocket sign handiness. Okay, and then also logic, probably, for the astronaut career. So I'm going to stop working the um, rocket and feed the cow plant, and I guess go greet my neighbors. Alright, let's invite neighbors in. There's not much to look at. <laughs> but y'all are welcome in. So we got Jennifer Hayashi, Soy Hayashi, Kenta Hashimoto, and Meridia Riddle. Okay. Nice to meet all of you. How y'all doing? Um... I wonder which houses they live in. Cause we got we got this house, we got that house, we got that house, and we got this house. <gasps> so they live in one of those houses. Listen, guys, there's not much in this house. Oh, she's in the ground. Are you okay? Oh, my game is already like. Ugh. No, I'm not even answering. I'm not even. Not even. Where are you going? I was gonna actually talk to you. Cheerful introduction. Um. I don't want to do a rude introduction. Oh, I guess I should do that actually. I thought I already fed the cow plant. Yeah, I was like, I thought I already fed the cow plant. Why am I having to feed the cow plant again? Also, there appears to be floating rocks, by the way. I'll fix that later. Oh gosh. She about tripped on a rock or a bush. I don't know what just about happened, but something. That man technically just got ran over. Where are we going? Oh. Why is she going this way? And like, I'm running way far ahead of her. Man, look at that house. Yeesh. 
Yeah, I actually had to stop at one point and go back into live mode to take the decorations down because the decorations were annoying the crap out of me. Is she coming out this way? And if so, why is she coming out this way when... Are you an alien? Trinity Strahd. That's the last name of Vlad. Great new neighbor. Go to work. No, okay. Uh, no. I'm sorry, guys. I gotta go work. Y'all came at a really bad time. I'm not not going to work. That's just not happening. Okay, I'm gonna make her actually socialize with coworkers. So we're gonna make friends with some coworkers. I have people at my house. Um, well, I'm at work. So, you know, that's not really that great that there's people at my house while I'm not there, but what else do I have? Oh, wait, does no one live here? Oh, I don't think anyone lives in that nice house. At least not right now. Sorry I didn't get to talk to y'all more. I actually tried to greet y'all, but for some reason we ran all the way down at the end of the curb. Um, not really quite sure what that was about, but... Alright, Natalie is back home. I did have an opportunity, a thing popped up, and I had a chance to try to help her work performance, which um, did actually get. I don't know if I'm getting double because of the ambitious trait. I'm not really sure why that's double. It's the only thing I think of because it says the ambitious trait helps like work performance or work something with work. But I did meet Violet and... Oriana while at work. So, she did meet two people. She does know two co-workers. We're not actually- <gasps> Mother! Mother, 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 mother! Why can't I talk to her? I can't click on her. Yeah, I, I legit just can't click on her. Okay, I don't know why I can't click on her, but I can't. Um... We are going to feed a treat to Lulu the second. We're going to feed the cow plant. Uh, my fun is technically down, but I don't really... don't have too many things that actually help fun. I don't know if fishing would help fun. I also don't know if I can fish. Like, this doesn't seem like a lot of room to fish. <laughs> um, fishing might help her fun, though, so we're going to try that. You know, we don't have a whole lot of things going on in the house. So feed the cow plant. Yeah, I don't think we can reach it. Go here. Go fishing. Yeah, she can't. I can build a sand sculpture <laughs> in my backyard. <laughs> With that. Why did we choose to go to a rockier, more grass there? Anyway, this is helping my fun though, so I'm going to build a um, sand sculpture in my backyard <laughs> to help with my fun. And then after that, I'm probably going to go to bed. We've been sleeping on. <laughs> Are we making a gnome? We made a gnome. That at least got our fun somewhat up. We, need, we at least needed a little bit of fun. Oh gosh, fruitcake. I wish I would have actually got to meet my neighbors, but you know. Eh. It made her way. Uh, he died shortly after we got here. I'm gonna take a bubble bath. Because I'm sad. I'm gonna have some pancakes. Oh, oh. <sighs> and after I have pancakes, I'm gonna use the bathroom. At least this is also helping our fun with the bubble bath. The bubble bath! Um, can we play with the cow plant? Will that help with our fun? Monster stop the sculpture. <laughs> play with cow plant again. <laughs> Trying to get her fun up any way I can. Also, I really... I'm worried about Connor being abducted by aliens. It says zero children. 
doesn't say he's pregnant. I think we're good. <laughs> I think we're good. <laughs> I was really concerned about this. Oh, these are our co-workers, I guess. Open, so we have Oriana. Yeah, co-workers. So we have, you're adorable. Um, anyway, and then we have Violet. You also are adorable, but you need some help with your CC a little bit. I mean, you're out, like, I don't know. This, this isn't, this doesn't, there's too much stripes and pattern. It's too much going on there. Anyway. Um, I also just, like, CC. Um, especially at least when it comes to the hair. Ah, uh, anyway. I can fix you up later, girl. <laughs> but we did meet two of her co-workers. My neighbors are already mad at me. <gasps> they aged up, yes. <laughs> they aged up. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay, that gives me some hope. <laughs> I can have made sound. It might sound bad, but I'm like partially really hoping that maybe him and her can get along. But yeah. Oh, wait. Her last name's changed. Her last name's changed. It doesn't say if she's married, though. But her last name's changed. Huh. Interesting. Like, it says he has a spouse, but it doesn't say she has a spouse. And I, I don't have to meet them, because obviously, like... There's no way she's met her spouse. Or her spouse. I, technically her spouse came with her. Or her spouse. Anyway. I like how we're in a playful mood, but we can't get our phone up. Feed. I can't play with him because it's cake. the cake's out. Okay, feed the cow plant, and then play with the cow plant. Play with. I should have got a telescope so that I can still keep getting the the prints. Dang it. Feed. Why did I hit feed? I meant play with. Is he still gonna eat it even though I just fed him? I was gonna say, I was like, I just fed you. <laughs> Dude. Can I get fun from the rocket ship? <laughs> I feel like I feel like someone like her would find fun out of building a rocket ship, but I don't know if the Sims does that. I'm gonna say no. Yeah, I don't see it going up. Yeah, no, it's going down. <laughs> She's for some reason not getting fun from this, even though I feel like she should. Does the skeleton the skeletoscope the telescope does that get fun? I'm gonna get the telescope. Because I want to keep getting the prints. One, I want to collect them. Two, I can sell them. So, um, I do want to get those. Okay, it should have, oh, yeah, right there it is. Alright, so I'm going to put the telescope, this is under tree, but technically I think I put it, like, really far out here. I, I yeah, like, there's sun on it, so I wouldn't be seeing the tree leaves. Okay. So we're gonna put that like right there. And does the telescope provide fun though? <laughs> that is the serious question right now. So I'm gonna have her stop doing this just to see if the telescope gives her fun. And if it does. Oh, I forgot I have bills to pay already. Does it help her fun? Well, she stopped. Well, she's feeding the cow plant again, for whatever reason. Um, let me pay the bills. Just wonder if you want to go over her house and hang out. <gasps> yes! I have been invited! And they just saved up! <laughs> yes. I don't know how much time I have left to record, because 
my time's messed all up because I was building. Okay, so we're actually back in Evergreen Harbor. But we are here to visit our friends who are now also adults themselves. So, yes. Discuss interests. That's your dad. Wish your brother. <laughs> Also, didn't they have the little sister? I think she aged up too. Okay, so this is where they live. Okay. I think they were our closest neighbor then. Technically. Because, yeah, right there's that house. So, yeah, there's the community. Yeah, they were the closest neighbor we had. But where is the brother. Y'all's bedrooms haven't been updated, it looks like. So, <laughs> don't know how the sleeping situation's going on, but you know, hey. Oh, is our brother not here? That's a that's some weeds you got going on there, dude. I think he's actually weeding it as I, as we speak. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I sort of want one of my gins to go to university, but I don't know which one to go. Where's your brother? Oh, I gotta go to work again. Offer oh, gratitude. Thank you. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you for being my friend. Like my first friend. She's adorable. Also, I didn't see the other sister, so I don't know where the other two kids are. Sort of sad. The brother's not here. <laughs> Wanted to get to know. I guess I can invite them over. Anyway, I actually think I'm going to end this episode here, so Nanalee is heading off to work. I might try to make her make some more friends at work, or at least socialize with co-workers some more. See if she can meet anyone else that works there. Just so she can start having f more friends and stuff. So, you know, we don't- we want some regular friends as well as human friends. But I hope you like this episode. It was a lot of, like, sort of building in this episode, sort of, because I don't know how, how much I'm leaving in of that. I will be speeding it up, but I still don't know, even after I speed it up, how much I'm leaving in. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If so, hit that level like button. Subscribe if you haven't already, so that you don't miss out on future Not So Very episodes, as well as other things here on the channel. I have a few different things on the channel, most of them Sims related, so if you like Sims, there's definitely quite a bit of options here on the channel. And for now, I will be going but hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Till then, bye-bye!